we're at it uh, as the uh, wrap up to the 10 a.m. turn on June 3rd, we have a spotting. So your guys uh, moved into observable observable range, excuse me, uh, for this so that you could uh, potentially launch against this, uh, what you believe to be a Mavis, against this uh, aircraft here. And by doing that, you uh, let me know that you were within three hexes of me. So I went through the, uh, the exercise of finding you. And what I did was, uh, was uh, you know, move in, in a non-direct approach. So I used up my movement points uh, it's not that hard to work out where you were coming from uh, since you're obviously not coming from the left hand side of the map I randomly moved this way uh, to try and get a, as my information on you grew better uh, we moved closer to you and it took a little bit of zigzagging to actually get to that stage and we moved these two guys in reaction to that uh, keeping uh, our two hex search pattern going got other guys there and we're moving this way. Now clearly we're also, we also just bounced into uh, observable range here. So I've had to share information with you that, uh, that there are aircraft here. And that will now mean next turn, I will begin moving uh, in a pattern around here to try and get within two hexes so that I know where you are. So uh, a little bit tricky and clearly I can't um, I can't completely randomize my movement because there's some factors that, that I know. I know that you're in a box. Uh, we know you're not behind me and we know that you're three within three hexes. So you're um, in this kind of arc and I'm going to move this unit in a, in a zigzag pattern to try and identify where you are so that I receive information about you and know more about you and then try and improve upon that. And that's how we're, we're doing this. Now, it's not perfectly, uh, it's not the same as playing a double blind game, but it's pretty close. And I'm trying to keep uh, things more interesting for you than it is for me. Uh, and not tie my little brain in knots. Uh, trying to keep this, uh, I guess, uh, as, as realistic as possible without bifurcating my brain. So, all right, there you go. Uh, so we've got uh, a couple of interesting things going on this turn. It'll be fun to see how this is handled, whether you guys launch a strike package from, uh, from Midway or from one of the aircraft carriers, or whether, uh, and what happens down here behind these guys with the Catalina. So it's uh, all fun and games at the moment.